Today's video is a toss up between Jollibee and McDonald's here in Manila, Philippines. And after a tiny bit of research, according to Google, there are 1,300 Jollibee stores in the Philippines, but only 640 McDonald's in the Philippines. But of course, if you take into account the whole world, McDonald's has close to 38,000 stores. Jollibee has 1,200. So that's right. Today's video is an idea we've had for a little while now, and today we are putting it to the test. Yes. We're both incredibly hungry. We have not eaten breakfast today. Looking at this, I don't think we're going to eat dinner today. This is going to be... I think this will sort us out for lunch and dinner. Definitely. As we've travelled around the Philippines, we've known that Jollibee, from you guys in the comments as well, we've known that Jollibee is such a big part of Filipino life, Filipino yes. upbringing, childhood, childhood yeah. memories, that kind of thing. And the, I guess the kind of biggest rival is McDonald's. Whenever we've done Jollibee videos, Jollibee reviews, yeah. trying Jollibee for the first time and stuff. This kind of underlying battle has always come into it. McDonald's In versus Jollibee. Yeah. So today we wanted to do the ultimate showdown. Honestly, anytime, anywhere in the Philippines, I'm not joking, you see the Jollibee, you look somewhere else and there's gonna be a McDonald's sign. They're Within always, very close proximity. They're always so close to each other. And on road trips, often we'll be eating either McDonald's or Jollibee because it's quick, it's fast food, it's drive throughs It's something we've consumed a lot of having been in the Philippines. We feel yes. like we've tried a lot of these items before, but never back to back, never side by side. When you take a bite of one and a bite of the other, I feel like we're gonna fully now decide which one we prefer, yeah. which one is best. Lucy, Lucy and I, up to this point, we enjoyed both. We like different yeah. things from different from both places. So for ordering today, we've tried to match items as close as we can. Exactly, so we'll talk through it as we go, but for example, we've ordered spaghetti from both. However, some items don't have an equivalent, like directly, so for example, we know that in the UK you can get like a chicken burger in Jollibee. You can't get that here in Manila. That's true. So instead we've ordered something that we feel like is like a rival for it and a similar kind of thing. You'll see later on in the video, but that's kind of the idea here. We've got a one piece chicken meal and a one piece chicken meal. Um, yep. We've also got this little camera here, we're going to do some close-ups We've got a second with. camera so we can show you guys exactly our view, what we're looking at. We can give you guys close-ups of the food. Close-ups of me. So because we're here in the Philippines, McDonald's does items that it wouldn't do if we were in the UK. Yes. So luckily we can compare the chicken meals, yes. we can compare the spaghetti. So I think we need to stop talking, I think we need to get into these items 100%. and see what we think. So I have a question for you before we begin. Okay. I'd be ordering on you, Food Panda. Yeah. Which one do you think costs more? And what can you give me a rough Ooh. price for McDonald's, a rough price for Jollibee that you think they cost? I, I reckon they were around a similar price because okay. we kind of ordered the same things. I'm going to say between four and six hundred pesos. Did you look? No. Did you look? No. Okay, that's very vague. Which one was more expensive? Okay, I'm going to say McDonald's was more expensive. That's what I thought that you would say. McDonald's was 451 pesos for all of this food, okay. which is really good. Uh -huh. Jollibee was 486. Oh, wow. Jollibee was a little bit more, but not by much. So what we're going to do, I'm going to eat the McDonald's, Lucy's going to eat the Jollibee, then we're going to swap yeah. per item, if that makes sense. We didn't we know, can swap and We didn't swap. know the best way to do this. You start with McDonald's first, okay. and then I'll start Jollibee first in the next item. Alright, fine. So we're, anyway. gonna, so we're going to go straight in with fries. Oh. <laughs> So glad you said that. Now, fries are a staple dish of any fast food outlet. We have to say, we're both disappointed at the portion size that we've been given here today. Apparently these are both large. I don't know if I ordered this wrong, but this firstly, this is a lot larger. Both, neither of them are actually full. Like both of them have got a lot of gaffage. Um, I feel like you see a classic McDonald's fries photo and you see the fries like sticking out the top of it. Not the case here. Okay, so I'm gonna go for McDonald's fries, Looking at which mine, I mine do look, like. Mine are definitely salted, are yours? These should be salted, yeah. Oh yeah, George used to work in McDonald's, so he's I gonna do. have high. But that's no advantage or disadvantage. Hmm, these really taste like Burger King fries to me. Do they? These taste like classic McDonald's fries. So I do like McDonald's fries, but I've never tried them back to back Jollibee. So I think they're gonna be different. They taste the like color. classic. They are very different. And but these are really nice and salty. I feel like these are more coated. True. When I say Burger King fries, do you know what I mean? Like a bit thicker yeah. around the edge. Yeah. Let's go in. Hmm. I do, oh, there's something about McDonald's fries. Something about them. I just love it. How different? So different. So, so different. You don't realise how different they are until you try them back to back. Keep talking and I get to eat these more. <laughs> now I've had a few of these, I'm getting more into it. Which one the do you The coating. Okay. I'm actually going to go Jollibee on this one. I'm going McDonald's. There's just something. I don't know what they put in these. I don't know what it is. I just can't stop eating them. So I need to put them down or I won't be hungry for the rest of it. 
So I've got the double yum burger. Cheesy bacon yum burger. Cheesy bacon yum burger, which actually looks good. It looks way bigger. If you compare them like side chunkier. by side, it's bigger and it's heavy. Yeah. Okay, go Definitely for it. got a different cheese as well. Definitely. And this is kind of the only thing I could find on the menu that's a double burger, so that's why we've gone for this today. Okay. This is so good. I knew I'd, I knew I'd love this, because this is like the mm -hmm. thing I order at McDonald's. It's like my one thing I order. This I'm is, a huge fan. This is good too. It tastes kind of like a, more like a school canteen burger. The taste of the meat is so different to McDonald's. Mm -hmm. uh, but the bacon's good, the cheese is good, the bread is good, the bread is tasty. And I quite like the sauce in here as well. Okay, for me, on this one, I'm going for McDonald's. You've got to say a It's wide. a childhood memory. Yeah. The, the, the taste is so familiar, it's delicious to me. I really like this. I like it is good. the burger. It is tastes, good. It tastes like a barbecue but burger. But we're having to choose it. It tastes a lot more like meaty. The meat tastes like meat. Yeah, absolutely. That doesn't taste like meat. So you're going for Jollibee on this one. I'm really surprised that I'm saying this, but I think I am. Honestly, I thought the double cheeseburger would have it for me because it's my staple McDonald's. I can't believe I'm saying this. I think I'm going Jollibee on this one. This is an item that UK McDonald's does not do. And I have to say, just a comparison on visuals, remember we're only really comparing two different stores, but I think the McDonald's looks a bit more appetizing this time round. They're both very small again. It's a bigger piece of chicken. The presentation is identical here. Yeah. Oh, it does look quite nice and crispy. Oh, it back. does look quite good actually. So yeah, we have got some nice crispy chicken for both. Two, I think we've got two good pieces here. Okay, so we've got our rice, we've got our gravy on both. This is the one piece meal that comes with both of them. The rice stays nice and warm for ages. I it's love this rice, I can eat it like this, this is weird. No, I think you're meant to just like kind of take a bite. Mm. I love this rice, I love Jollibee rice. So much. And I don't think it's a thing. I know you're copying me, but I don't think you're meant to just eat it like that. Oh. Okay, let's okay, go. We're just gonna take some big bites here. Mm. Oh, I love it. That is so good. Really nice dark meat, it's so salty. Okay, swap straight away so we get the instant mm -mm, bit of comparison. Test. But I'm losing, I'm forgetting mm, the flavour. Okay. Okay, not bite. <laughs> Alright, swapping over. Oh, yours is a lot whiter than me, but I guess it's, it's just true. a different cut. This is like it a is, drumstick. It is. Mm. Mm. Wow, it's so different, George. I did not have any idea. Really different. I'm so surprised at how different it is. I honestly thought they were the same. Like when I've had them separately, I've been like, oh yeah, similar kind of thing. The spices, it, it, there's more spice going on here, a bit more like different flavours, that's it a bit more classic. very different, but I've made my decision Me on too. this one. Mine's a 100% easy decision. Mine's Jollibee. Me too. Okay. So spaghetti, now this is something that when we first came to the Philippines, we were kind of shocked that there was spaghetti in a fast food restaurant because coming from the UK, yeah. we just hadn't seen that. But we then learned it's a real staple of the Jollibee menu. I'm pretty sure McDonald's only does it here to directly rival Jollibee. Yeah, definitely. Because I've never seen McDonald's do, do spaghetti. I've never even tasted McDonald's spaghetti. So this is gonna be a real no, first true. time taste. Oh, I, 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 I like McDonald's. the McDonald's cutlery actually. It's nice and sturdy and thick. Um, very, very, very It's literally the same on it. Mine's got a little line on it. <laughs> and a close up look at both of these. This is the Jolly Spaghetti from Jollibee. And look, spaghetti I mean, it's, course, it's, it's cool? identical. It's got look, the, spaghetti. It's got the grated cheese. It's got the pieces of hot dog. It's like a sweeter sauce, isn't it? Yeah. It smells very tomato. It smells good. We've got the cheese on top, the spaghetti, a little bit of sausage. I'm pretty sure that Jollibee's gonna come out as the winner for me on this one because I really am a fan of Jollibee spaghetti. I order it whenever I go. This is good. It's quite rich, the tomato sauce. Mm -hmm. I like the sweetness in here. I like the bits of meat. The spaghetti's cooked perfectly. I really Same like the flavour. Really, really good. I wonder if they're very, very similar. Are you ready to swap? Mm -hmm. So in terms of the actual spaghetti, when it's been in the sauce, this is a lot more vibrant and orange. That's a lot more pale. That's true. I don't true. know what that means. That's true. No idea what that means. I'm saying it as though it means something. <laughs> it doesn't. Okay, let's try the McDonald's. Mmm. They're so different, George. Totally different. What's the difference? I can't even describe it. Completely different. The meat's, the meat's harder. It's got, the meat's a little bit more chewy in McDonald's. And the sauce isn't quite as good, a little bit, maybe it's a little bit less sweet actually. It tastes more, a bit more like an Italian tomato sauce. I prefer that because of that. I don't think I like sweet spaghetti really? as much. I still, I'm still gonna stick with the Jollibee for this one. Okay, I'm, I'm definitely McDonald's. 
So we know that these next two items are very different. You can't really directly compare them, yeah. but we wanted to order something on the menu that's kind of like, almost like a side or a smaller item. A special for that place. Yeah, something a little bit different on the menu. So you, we already said that you can't get chicken burgers in Jollibee here, mm -hmm. um, but also you can't get hot dogs in McDonald's, we found. Very true. So, so that's what's the thing here. For this round, we're gonna give a point to either Jollibee or McDonald's just based on what we prefer out yeah. of these two items. So I'm gonna have a little bite of the McDonald's the way, chicken burger. I can't remember what, how, who's got what votes. We'll, we'll have to work it out when we're editing this video. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's a nice hot dog. Can't complain. The bread's good, the meat's good, the toppings are good. Very meaty meat again. It's a nice burger. Can't complain. The meat's good, the bread's good. The sauce is what gets me. In Let's a good way? swap, but I think McDonald's is taking me on this one. Oh, it li you like the sauce? Yeah, you I like it. You said it was a bad thing. No, I really like the mayo in that burger. Got a little, uh, bit How about of, I got a little bit of, bit of chicken oh, in right, okay. It's good actually. It's like a thin piece of chicken. Oh, I'm also a fan of this hot dog. Mm. Oh, I don't know what I'm going to choose. That is so good with the mustard. Mustard mayo, I think it is. Okay, Jollibee, Jollibee for me. Point to Jollibee. Mm. I would choose that over that. I agree. All right. So this next one, we've got the classic burger steak from Jollibee, which I am a huge fan of. You've got like the mushroom gravy sauce. But I've, I've never had that actually. The closest thing we could find on the McDonald's menu to it was a Mukdo burger, which they also don't do in the UK. It looks like it's a burger in a sauce, but instead of being served with rice, it is served in the bun. Yes. So I've got my fork and spoon. I'm gonna. What's the sauce? I don't know. I don't know what the sauce is. It looks kind of like a gravy or something with. Oh, no, that's gravy. Yeah. Is it? I'm gonna I'm get gonna mushroom and some rice for the perfect bite. Good. The burger actually tastes a lot like the burger steak from Jollibee. I actually really like that. The sauce is good, the burger's good, and the rice is obviously good. This tastes a little bit sweet. I can't figure out. I think it might be the buns a little bit sweet in this, but it's really nice. It's a decent burger. This is a decent quick meal, you know, mm. on the go. By the way, we had this food delivered to us, obviously. Yeah. It took about 10 minutes to come. So much quicker than any other fast really food good. or any other takeaway we normally get. Okay, the McDonald's burger. What did you say the sauce was like? It tastes sweet to me. I don't know what really? it is. It's like really bright orange. Again, it just tastes. Why do I get saying this? The meat tastes really meaty from. Jolly, uh, from Jollibee. I think this is pork. I really? Think, I think the patty is pork. Show me. In the McDonald's burger. It looks different and it tastes slightly different. I have a feeling it is. Comment below if you know. The McDo really? burger. Yeah. It, it, looks, it looks more like the breakfast sausage meat. Oh, yes. Maybe that's why it tastes sweetest to me as well. Mm. Hmm. Let us know in the comments, guys. For me, this cool. one's easy. Jollibee, again. Me too. Mm. Jollibee takes my heart on that <laughs> round. <laughs> Dessert time, guys. The famous McDonald's apple pie. And the equally famous Jollibee mango peach pie. The first thing I'm noticing. Whoa, this is Well, that is really small, but I was gonna say the McDonald's is so much smaller than when I was a kid and I used Gosh. to have an apple pie. Do you remember how long they were? Yes. It's halved, it's half down. Look at this, George, that is really small, right? Honestly. This is a lot smaller than I thought they were. The comparison. But they look similar. But I mean, they look crispy, they look delicious. This looks more bubbly again. It's like the fries. It looks like there's more going on, more of a coating. Yeah. I have a real soft spot for the mango. Is it mango peach pie? Yeah. I have a real soft spot for that pie. It's delicious. I'm, I, I think I know where I'm going to vote on this one. This just totally reminds me of being a kid. The hot apple, the cinnamon. I'm glad we've let this cool down a little bit because these used to burn my tongue mm. when I was a kid, every single time. The amount of times my mum would be like, do not eat it yet, wait, and I'm like, yeah. no, I'm hungry. And it just burns all your taste buds. Okay, yeah. let's swap. I do love the Jollibee one. I love the pastry. I love the sweet mango and the juice, but I, I know I'm a real big fan of the apple pie too. Mm. Wow. Easy for me. Jollibee takes it for me there. I haven't had this in so long. I'm getting flashbacks. I think really? I like this kid. more. Really? Okay. I've had that for so, like, I've had mango peach pie way more times recently. Delicious, so, so good. This one tastes like the sauce is so sweet. I love yeah. it. So here are our results on the screen, guys. As you can see, both of us favored Jollibee in this yeah. test. We hope we gave like a fair comparison with I the menu items did. and things. There was enough things there. If you think that we missed out a certain item or you think something meant that we maybe favored one or not the other, I don't know, let us know in the comments if you think this was like a fair test. Definitely. And if there's other ones that we should have been comparing as well. Comment below also guys, if there's any other foods you want us to do a comparison yes. test with, a taste test. If you like these kind of videos, please give it a thumbs up. Comment below what you prefer. Jollibee and McDonald's. For Jollibee every item. McDonald's. For every item. <laughs> I, I, hope, I hope there's someone who will take the effort to list it out in a comment yeah. and tell us what they prefer. That'll be cool. 
So this was a bit of a different video today, guys. We hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you're new. And, and we'll see you in the next daily food test. Food review. Daily food review. No, that's already a YouTube channel. Sorry, we can't use that. Don't say that. Don't say that. We'll see you in the next stages. <laughs>